Member for Vancouver West End. Thank you, Honourable Speaker. One of the first reasons that I decided to enter into politics at the provincial level was the challenge of homelessness. Too many people in my community were ending up on the streets due to illegal evictions, due to poverty, due to missed checks, due to missed payments. And, Honourable Speaker, while we can build more affordable housing and supportive housing to help people who become homeless, I often think it's just as important that we work on the reasons someone is to become homeless. Honourable Speaker, I want to celebrate the BC Rent Bank and the network of rent banks across this province. Now, for those that don't know what a rent bank is, it's something I learned too. A constituent had come to me, uh, she was sleeping in her van. Uh, she missed some payments on rent because she'd been sick and had to take the time off work. She'd been living close to the edge. Now, she said to me, if I just had a small loan, that I could have paid the landlord, I could have kept my home, I wouldn't have lost my things, I wouldn't have lost my job, and I wouldn't have had to sleep in my van for two years. So my office got to work. We pulled together the Van City Community Foundation, NISIS, the City of Vancouver, the Street to Home Foundation, and we founded the Vancouver Rent Bank. We'd had a small rent bank operating in the east side, but nothing for the West End and nothing for the rest of Vancouver. That foundation, that start, help thousands of people stay in their homes from about 2012, 2013 on up to now. But it wasn't enough for just Vancouver because we know there are these stories in all of our communities. You all know people, you've all heard from people come to your offices needing that help, desperate, nowhere to turn. Maybe they don't have family, maybe they've just moved there. Maybe they're at their end of the limit. Rent banks can help those people now in every part of this province. Our government invested in them because we believe you should help before somebody becomes homeless. That's just as important as helping somebody when they are homeless. Thank you, Honourable Speaker.